Hey guys, and welcome back to another A-Level Maths Tricky Exam question. And in this question here today, we've got an integration by parts. So we're asked to find the exact value of ln x divided by x squared with the limits from e to 1. So we have to write the answer in the form a plus b over e, where a and b are integers. So let's take this step by step. We're asked to do it by parts, but we have this expression here where it's a quotient. So we need to get it in some form of a product. So let's rewrite this. So what we have here is the integral from e to 1. And we can rewrite this. Remember this, this uh, denominator here, x squared, we can write as x to the minus 2. So this is ln x, ln x times x to the minus 2. So times x to the minus 2 like that. So we've rewritten the integral and we now need to pick what we pick as u and what we're going to pick as dv by dx. So if we do this over here, so u, so remember we use late, so late, to pick what we are using for u. So u is going to be logs, algebra, trigs and exponential. So l is logs, we have log here, we have the natural log of x. So we're going to pick u as ln x. So what that means is that dv by dx must be x to the minus 2, or 1 over x squared. So that's x to the minus 2, like such. So now let's work out the corresponding bits we need. So du by dx, that's going to be the derivative of ln x, nice and easy. 1 over x. So that's 1 over x. Now we need to integrate this dv by dx to get just v. So v, so the integral of x to the minus 2, so we're going to add 1 to the power, divide by the new power. So this would be the same as just minus 1 over x, because that would be x to the minus 1, so it's going to be x like that. So we've got the information we need. Now we need to use the formula for by parts and then just carry on with the integral from there. So by parts, remember, so this is in your formula book, you don't need to worry about memorising it, but just remember, it's uv minus the integral of v du by dx. Like such. So if we do this now, what we're going to get? So u times v, so ln x times minus 1 over x. So if I rewrite this, um, if we write it here, it's going to be minus 1 over x times ln x. That's my uv bit. Minus the integral of, so v minus 1 over x times du by dx, so times 1 over x. This is minus 1 over x, so we can plot a minus here, and because it's minus over minus, this will this integral will become positive now. So this is minus 1 over x. Ln x still. That's ln. Ln x, so it's going to be positive, and then if you do 1 over x times 1 over x, we're going to get 1 over x squared. So 1 over x squared, remember, is just the same as what we had here. So this is going to become x to the minus 2. Again, let's perform this integral here, which we've already done. We know that is going to be minus 1 over x. So this now is going to be minus 1 over x uh, times ln x. And then we've got the minus 1 over x here, minus 1 over x, like that. So we've got the resulting integral here now, the result. Now we just need to sub in our limits here. So e is the upper limit. 1 is the lower limit. So we sub these in, what are we going to get? So we're going to get minus 1 over e times ln e. So what's ln e? So remember ln e is just 1. Ln e is 1. So this is minus 1 over e times 1. So minus 1 over e minus 1 over e again. We're just replacing the x here with minus 1 over e. So that's the first part of the integral. Now we need to sub off, uh, subtract the second bit, so this with the, the 1 going in. So minus 1 over 1 times ln 1. Well, remember, ln 1 is just equal to 0. 
so that's just going to be zero for this part and then minus so minus one over one like that which is just going to be one so let's just rewrite that as minus one and then if we carry out this, the you know the simplifying here this is minus one over e minus one over e so that becomes minus two over e and then minus minus one is plus one and there we have it we found it in the form a plus b over e so b is minus two or two you're taking the minus out and then a must be one and there we have it so that's the result of the integral for the six marks